Hey y'all, it's Christy Cook from Teen Idols. It's time to announce the winners of the Yarny Goodness Surprise Giveaway. Are y'all excited? I'm excited. So excited I haven't even changed out of my fancy work clothes <laughs> yet. Um, so I had to go ahead and pick them. I know y'all probably been waiting. I said I was going to announce it today. I had to wait till I get off work, y'all. Um, I'm going to try to upload this directly from my phone, so we'll see how that goes. I don't know how that's going to go, cause, so I don't have to take so long. Otherwise, it'll be midnight before this thing gets up. It's ridiculous. Um, so, plus I got my chair in the mail today, and I need to put it together. I'll put on my maker clothes, put it together, and finish sewing. Um... One thing before, I know y'all ready for the winners. Hold on just a second. <laughs> the quilted maker totes that I showed, well, except the batik ones, they've all been claimed. That orange and blue and gray ones, that I, I think I put a picture on Instagram too. They have all been claimed by somebody. I did not expect them to sell out that fast. Um, I haven't even finished them yet. Uh, I had an issue last night and I had to put them down, but I'll be finishing them today. And I will make some more quilted totes. Um, there may be some more in that type of fabric. Um, I've got to do some research on that. I did not expect them to be that popular or sell out that fast. So I will be making more quilted uh, maker totes. Okay, y'all? But those will not make it into the shop because they already have been claimed. So also, I, I've had a, several people ask, and I told someone that I would do a video Friday about the different bag sizes and pricing and how much, or and about what they hold and stuff. I didn't get to do that video this past week, so I'm going to try to do it this week, and I will show the different bags and the sizes that I, that I have that are typical sizes I put out on a fairly regular basis. Um, because some of the bags that I do are just called Maker's Leftovers. It's like I have leftovers and I make bags with them. So they're not typical. But I do have some typical ones. And I'm going to put together a PDF with the sizes and prices for my typical bags. Then I'll have to download under that video. So um, I'm going to work on that sometime this week. I don't know what day that's going to happen. So, But it's coming. Um... You can check out my shop. I do think I have... I gotta think about that. I think I have one regular. That might not be true. Y'all, sometimes stuff sells out faster than I realize. But you can check it out. Any of the ones that are called maker bags, like the maker zipper or drawstring bag or the maker tote or... I don't have any mega maker bags or traveling maker bags in there currently, but those are the biggest bags that I make. Anything that says maker and doesn't say maker's leftovers is a typical size bag. <laughs> so <laughs> the mini maker bags, I have a bunch of those in there. So anywho, I'm working on that so that y'all will have a reference um, if, when you have questions. That's so. It's also something I can send to people when they have questions, so I don't have to try to remember <laughs> all the dimensions and all that stuff. So, okay, now we're going to announce the winners. I know y'all waiting on that. I would have rambled on too long already. So, I put all, I did the random comment picker. I picked two commenters. Um, I did make sure that they were subscribed. And the first one, the, remember the way this works. The first one, if you had something you liked in particular, I'll make sure it's in your box. And the second one, if they ask for the same thing, it goes to the first person. But luckily, these two people did not say they liked the, the same things. So that's good. So I'll make sure that that's in your box. But the other stuff will be a surprise. And I'll try to make it even for y'all. Um, the first winner is Susan B. I don't think I had more than one Susan B. But just in case... Her comment was, I'm pointing like I'm going to put something up here, but I probably won't because I'm going to upload this from my phone. I'll make sure it's in the description, though, y'all. Um, I am crocheting a sunflower afghan and two shawls. I love the velvet set. 
So congratulations, Susan B. We'll make sure that that is in your box. Um, winner number two is Beth Tatum. Beth Tatum. Um, her comment was, thank you for the giveaway. I like all of the yarns, but especially I especially like the baby yarn, the blue and teal, blue and yellow, white variegated. I can't even talk y'all. And the red and teal set. I am currently working on an afghan with yarn be glowing and a poncho with latte cakes. So, that sounds wonderful, Beth. Congratulations to Beth. I will make sure that those things are in your box and everything else will be a surprise for you too. Ladies, I'm assuming those are ladies, um, you just email me your address and I'll be boxed. It'll probably be this weekend before I get it boxed up. Um, so, cause it's gonna take me a minute to get it, <laughs> to gather up a box to put all that yarn in y'all. Um, so congratulations to y'all. Um, don't forget to send me your, an email with your address. Um, I'm gonna wait a week and if I don't hear from you, I'm gonna pick another winner. Um, and those latte cakes, y'all, I want some of those latte cakes. It's on my list. I'm making a list of stuff I really want because I'm trying to wait till my yarn dots up. Even though I may or may not have ordered some yarn. We're not gonna talk about that right now. Anyway. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to end this before it gets any longer. Sorry about my fingers in your face. Uh, and I will see y'all later. Y'all have a great week. Bye.